something you need from me. He was really the heart of the free start. And I feel for the folk in the stretch. I try and give a credit or two to the low house when I'm able. By the way, Sergeant Yui was looking for you. Apparently, he's got some work. Hey, Sarah's friend. Take the elevator down to the Vanguard Orientation Hall. And if you've got any questions... I mean, I don't like the UC any more than the next guy, but... To live in your campus, but they like only let citizens live. Huh? From their foundation, 
the United Colonies strove to provide all their citizens with opportunity, security, and peace. But there were those among the UC that still wanted something more. Independence. So in 2161, the UC issued the Centaurus Proclamation, granting UC citizens the right to settle distant worlds and form their own sovereign powers. It wasn't long before the first new faction, the Free Star Collective, was formally organized in 2188, later followed by House Varun, revealing themselves to the universe in 2230. It was only in 2230 that the faction known as House Varun first made contact with the rest of the settled systems. Founded by the passengers of a colony ship that had left New Atlantis and disappeared four decades earlier, House Varun was a faction unlike any other. A theocracy dedicated wholly to the beliefs of its isolationist founder, Janan Varun. House Varun initially made overtures of peace towards the rest of the settled systems. They claimed their only intention was to spread the word of their god, the Great Serpent. But none could have guessed that this worship might take the form of a bloody war, the Serpent's Crusade. The Free Star Collective was initially founded in 2188, when the citizens of Aquila banded together with the pleasure city of Neon in mutual defense. But in 2194, after the deployment of a UC medical star station in orbit around their world, the citizens of Narion also requested to join the Collective. The resulting rise in tensions between the Free Star Collective and UC culminated in the Settled System's first intergalactic conflict, the Narion War. Despite a decisive victory by the UC, the colonies permitted the citizens of Narion to join the Collective, forming the basis for the fiercely independent union that persists to this day. Colonies Navy. 
After their shocking victory against the galaxy's greatest navy, the Free Star Collective offered terms of peace, which the colonies, out of an interest in saving off any further human costs, accepted. The galaxy has been rebuilding ever since. Few settled worlds were left untouched by the colony war. But nowhere could the viciousness of modern warfare be seen more clearly than on the free star planet of Nera. Initially occupied by invading United Colonies forces as a forward operating position, repeated attempts to take and retake the planet by collective forces led only to devastation. Swaths of the world were transformed into scorched husks, a nightmarish testament to the depths of human ingenuity and human cruelty. And today, Nera remains a continuing reminder to the horrors of unfettered war. In the midst of the colony war, a different kind of tragedy struck the UC city oh, of London. Four of my last science papers have been on terror. A newly constructed but critical supply center for the United Colonies you war effort. You know this from UC General that condemned London. Gave one of it the over to the state. One predators. of these murals said he was executed war. after the war. Might have gotten off too lightly. A rare and pervasive threat to all human settled worlds. Terror wars swept over the city, seemingly out of nowhere, on a scale never before seen in recorded history. Valiant efforts by the UC military slowed the onslaught, but the creatures proved unstoppable. Ultimately, the decision was made to destroy the Londinian spaceport, sealing off the city. The outbreak and its citizenry from the galaxy at large. The tragedy of Londinian is mourned by the UC to this day. One of my slates said terrorists can control people's minds. After the devastation wrought by the colony that war, the, the UC and the Freestar Collective came together to ratify a treaty that became known as the Armistice. Both sides agreed to a vast reduction in standing forces, and that Xeno weapons and mech warfare would be outlawed. All related research was sealed away, accessible only in cases of dire emergency. But the Collective had another demand, that the active commanders of the UC military stand trial for their actions. United Colonies in the interest of peace and galactic security agreed. In 2311, three United Colonies senior officers were found guilty. Commander Henry Durant, suit. General Indira Rastogi, and Fleet Admiral Francois Senon, known better as Ve Victus. All were sentenced to death for their actions, bringing the colony war to a close and returning peace to the galaxy at long last. It was into this new world that the Vanguard was born. An official branch of the UC Navy, the Vanguard is the United Colonies Volunteer Fleet, serving a myriad of security, logistical, and reconnaissance roles. And after a sufficient length of service, UC citizenship is guaranteed to every Vanguard member. Open to all captains, regardless of origin, the Vanguard is leading the charge to protect and support the citizens of the United Colonies, wherever in the galaxy they may be. No one is born a United Colony citizen, only through service to the UC can one hope to earn one citizenship. But the UC prides itself on taking care of its people. Cost of living controls mean citizens pay less than their foreign counterparts for needs big and small. All citizens are issued a grant upon joining to get themselves on their feet. And only UC citizens have the opportunity to purchase property, 
getting the chance to live in one of the most beautiful cities in the settled systems. By joining the Vanguard today, you too can begin earning your place here, in the heart of galactic civilization, as a citizen of the United Colonies.
Congratulations, applicant. You've passed. You can head up to Commander Tuwala to receive your final results and your probationary assignment. Or you're welcome to take another run at the simulation if you'd like to try and earn a better score. We'll only keep your best run. Yes? You needed something? Well, look who's back. Everything go all right with the exam? Or did you have some questions? Ah, so the... Then let's get to them. So, the... hit every mural in the... A test of preparation and thoroughness. Two traits that... Psychological results are all with... Navy doesn't have room for folks at all. Now... All right. We, we try to set a high bar. So then, looking at your... Ten-year service. So, sounds to me like if you're interested, we could bring you on, get you the credits you've earned. Then, first though, all UC service people. So, you want? Fantastic. right doing now the motto of the bank that is where we serve do you swear and to up then let me be the f now only th and what I've got is comms repair group trying to refurb an old places as isolated so can the people that's the spirit head down to the spaceport oh and you give it your all out Crime has slowed down since you started. Yep. Something just came in. Security on site handled it, but now one of the problem is he left without identifying the perps. So... Good. A restaurant. Oh, wait. It's the kind of place. Uh, it's a lot of work. Well, according to the patron, normally. See you later.
I do hope there is simply no parallel to the food you will find here. One taste, and ah, uh, the most. Well, I wasn't privy. So, well, the one, the other, excellent tipper. I wasn't witness to it. Oh yes, quite music, but this. I assume that would. I believe he. The dawn's roost represent anyone who has. Enjoy the rest of your day. Yes, what? Breath? Oh! Check. Shower? Hair? Check and double check. A lying, cheating. If I had my way, I'd tie him to the back of it. It's never Five let years! Down. You are ready for some It was supposed to be a romantic day. But an hour, I picked up a pair of pants to think. Still! He would say that. He gifted it. But I'm... As soon as my assistant finishes pack, he would say that he gifted. I don't care. I'm not giving.
How can I help, Captain? Ah, oh, perfect. Excellent. You acquitted you. Hardly surprising for a cap. Here, take. for leeches, get it fixed up, and let it know we'll have it ready as soon as we can. Ah, you are... It's my job to... Now, man, in addition to the standard med packs, some small arms, my people will have it. Hmm. Nice easy one for you. Any questions before? Then I won't keep you. Make us look good out. Back already. Nothing too dangerous, if that's your concern. The repair, the welcome kit has some goodies in there. I honestly didn't realize. Report they get. Just watch out for.
Groot had some good hunting. Inspect your ship for heat leeches in every couple lands. They'll cause plenty of havoc if anything I can help you with? Okay, no problem. I'm sure you can find. Some work done? Okay, no problem. Thank you. 